All right, let's continue Animal Crossing New Horizons. If you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for clicking and hope you've been enjoying so far. It looks like I have a... Yeah. I have a new building. Now then, I'm sure you can all guess what I'm going to tell you next. It's today's big announcement. As stated in a previous broadcast today, we've completed construction of the Resident Services building. That's not all the big news for today, we've also added someone to our island staff. Come on over. It's Isabel. Hello, I'm Isabel. As Mr. Nook said, I'm part of the Resident Services staff here on Shambolonia. While I still have much to learn, I will do my best to support everyone who calls this island home. Isabel has previously done the resident support work, so I'm sure she'll be a big help to everyone here. Hmm? I've got more to share. The building isn't the only new thing around here. We gave the plaza a much needed improvement as well. Normally the plaza is for residents and visiting peddlers who take advantage of this prime location. But keep an eye out for the occasional seasonal events too. Should be fun for everyone, yes yes. Well, I believe that wraps up all my announcements for today. Except one final thing, this was my very last broadcast. Signing tomorrow. Isabel will be a new source for Island News. I'll do my best to share the latest updates with you, so I hope you'll tune in often. Yes, yes, there you have it. New building, new island staff, we are growing, growing, growing. Finding out what's new at resident services is as easy as stopping by and inquiring, hmm? Of course, we plan on holding a ceremony to commemorate the new resident services building. We'd love for everyone to take part. I believe that sums it all up. Isabel and I will be there to help you whenever you need us. Okay. Now I can maybe get started with other stuff, we'll see. I will have gotten my first piece of music I can play at home as well. Okay. Celebrate the opening of Resident Services. We have lots of new Miles Redemption items, plus a new serve, new service of Nook Mile Pass to earn five times more miles. It's attached. Store. 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 At last, I'm reunited with my crew. The Sea Dogs would surely be sunk without that captain. I've sent you some pirate booty. As a reward, promise you'll gaze at it often, and spare a thought for me. Ah, oh, free ticket. <laughs> okay. Well, I got my music. thinking how I should do this. Oh, I know, I know, I have an idea. The most useful thing I can get it to do right now. Probably the most useful thing I can get it to do. Yeah, nice. Okay, that'll, that'll work. Just 
just a quick way for me to be able to get over there. Okay. Oh, Audi's here. How you doing, Foxtrot? Let's chat. You're out for a walk. Yay, I started walking earlier and hoped it would catch on. I'm such a trendsetter. Alice. Very good morning to you, world governor. Really glad to know that day by day I'm settling in here. I love my new life on the island and I love all my neighbors. Oh, before I forget, the reason I flag you down is that I wanted to give you a gift to celebrate us being neighbors. Just something to mark the start of what I hope is a lifelong friendship. It's something popular back home. Some cat grass? My original home, I mean. I know this is my home now. See you around, cat grass. Oh. I had no idea that's what it was. Register the song while I'm here. Guess that's the start. It's like it's almost like farting. I saw another one. have to do at some point a nighttime or evening one. 
just so I'm not stuck constantly in the morning. Shame it was that. rock. Otherwise it's always just gonna be against this path. It's a good thing it wasn't the money. It was probably a sea bass though. It's got times five for that one. That means the one that has it is probably up on the cliffs. 
Most likely the money one. Not oh, okay. Is there a rock? Hmm. Okay, well, this tree is going. Forgetting about a stone. One might be this one. There it is. Identify first and then I'll come back. <laughs> Bladders, wake up! 
Oh, the apartment. Uh, more than I can, uh, more than I say. Yeah, hang on. I'm just gonna look up something real quick. I need to decide on an island theme. There's, there's a lot. Oh wait, I want to assess again. Mammoth skull. Could it be? It is... a mammoth skull. Does this mean... Yes, it is done. The mammoth is complete, and the splendid specimen indeed. The mammoth was a remarkable creature. Alright, do it, lathers. Okay. Mammoths, the bad boys and girls of the ancient mammal world, so will the oxen kept. They are, of course, most famous for their size, which could be up to 13 tons for the largest males. But they were subject to no one's rules, and some species were smaller than modern elephants. Scientists have pondered for years, were mammoths the coolest of all extinct species? Perhaps so. Hey, Mrs. Ham, how's it going? Alright, next donation. This one. Okay. <laughs> What? How the fuck? Patches for Lawosaurus? That's a- that's like a hell of a word. The blunt was not the brightest star in the dinosaur firmament. What I mean is, with its incredible thick skull, some 10 inches thick in spots, it didn't have much room for, well, brains. Its brains was likely quite small, but at least it was extremely safe in this bony prison. That's what I have to say about- alright, so time- <laughs> I think we've read Spino before. Yeah, roughly the size of the T-Rex. Famous cousin. It's like a crocodile. Yep. Nothing new here. Parasol. Please. Parasol Olifus. Parasol Olifus? Jeez. I like to think of it as the beast with the golden tones. You see, the three foot structure of hollow bone atop its head may have been an elaborate noisemaker. As a died in the feathers optimist and music fan, I like to think 
it serenaded the late Cre Cretaceous. Jeez. What does I have to say about that? Why do they have to give dinosaurs such complicated names? Like, Latin is dead as a language. Latin is absolutely dead as a language. And yet, we still insist on naming, <laughs> naming things with Latin. I don't know, do people just want to sound fancy when they name things? My outfit is disgraceful. Thank you, glad you like it. But you see, I I had a hundred different choices that I could have gone with, but I went with this one. Isn't Latin the basis of Italian? Latin is a root language for a lot of different languages. But we don't really practice classic Latin. More. Did you know that the only language that doesn't have any sort of ancestor and it's on its own and doesn't have any children is Albanian? It's probably the purest language in the world. And that's it for useless trivia. Alright, so I'm like two minutes early. On my clock it says it's 8am, but... I mean 8pm. I guess I can buy more stuff. Good morning. Alright. I'm just gonna buy everything, because I want them to open the store. A fishing vest. Speak Finnish and Italian because your parents. That is a pretty crazy mix. Because what Finnish is more, uh, it's like Eastern European. It's not the same as Scandinavian. It's pretty different. Like it's not the same as Swedish or Norwegian. It must have been hard to learn both of them. Volta or Alec, okay. Yeah, I wasn't sure, I just know that it's definitely different to, to other languages in that region. It's like more... shares more similarities with Russian. Or at least in terms of how it's spoken, I don't know. I could be wrong. one other person that has Finnish heritage, but they don't speak it as well. It's a fairly cute language. I haven't heard much of it. So it would probably sound neat just because don't hear it often.
Alright. Yeah, cool. Hey man, my name is Jose. I'm part of a boy band. Can you give me a discount? To your clothing store? I promise I'll wear your clothing to our next gig. Here, look at this poster. I'm not going to explain the reference. It's fine. If you know the story, you know the story. Uncle Jose. He's not my uncle. He's my uncle's friend. But to be fair, my uncle is a character. What is this music? Man, of all the songs to find right away, I swear. I am now the Uncle Jose. Well, in spirit, maybe. I need to find new music. This the song is It just sounds like clown fart music. Not now, but at the start of it. Yeah, that. Hopefully she'll open a store soon and then I can get more clothing options. Right now I'm kind of, uh... Yeah, don't really have much choice. Somehow this came out color coordinated with the exception of the sandals. Alright, I need to find today's recipe. Seashell music player makes the songs nicer. I think I need to find it. I do have the DLC. I mean, this is still very early on. Like, I only just got the town center just today. I'm just missing the- I'm just missing the gold chain, honestly. <laughs> that's, that's it. And, um... Leather shoes. Ah, oh, well, hello, hello. Welcome to the new and improved resident services tent. Oh, did I say tent? Of course, I, I meant building, and we couldn't have built it without your help. Now, as I mentioned in my broadcast, we need to support- Oh, we need new support staff for a new building, so Isabel is here to take good care of us. Yeah, well, right? Mr. Nook has told me all about you. I just started today, so I'm sure I'll have my hands full learning all the ins and outs of my new job. But I'm already smitten with island life, so you can count on me to give my absolute best. And there you have it, Isabel and I will split up duties to better support you all. Broadly speaking, I'll take care of anything related to homes or construction issues. Isabel will help g with general island matters and resident support. Sit at the appropriate counter when you need help, and we'll rush over in two swishes of a raccoon's tail. In fact, have a seat now and we'll introduce you to some new services. Now, with that out of the way, I have something I'd like your help with. When you have a minute, please sit at my counter. I hope I can count on your continued support of Shamblonia and our new resident services building. My name doesn't sound Spanish. That's because it's my nickname. Well, 
We're sorry it was unavailable. To make up for that, we're giving any customers... Oh. Okay. That was easy. Battle vouchers to get... Pro... Yeah, this is what this is what we want. Customization begins now. No way, no way what? The customization out, but yeah, I only just got it now. And start looking at parving. I've been browsing some here and there. I don't think I'll make my own this time around. It just takes too long. Ultimate pocket. Oh, right. Yeah, storage. This is why I saved the miles. They're <laughs> all going away today. Do I want the pro camera pro creating license decorating license? Hip reaction collection. Eye colors, head, body paint, don't care. Donation box, drinking fountain. Yep, now the now the grind for the miles begins. Ooh. It's this color. I got this color. I forgot that the colors vary. You know what? I think I just noticed something. In my previous file. This statue was red. And then I found the bed. The, the, uh, the Orient, whatever that bed is, the Japanese style bed. That was also red. In this file, I find the bed again, it's blue, and the dinosaur is blue. I get the, I get the feeling that it just, when you generate an island, it picks a bunch of colors, and then that pretty much determines what you're going to get, or find. Because, yeah, look at this, yellow. That's why it's all color-coordinated, yellow, blue. I bet that's the case. This is red, but that's fine. Okay. Uh... Guess I'll get that. I still have enough to get everything. Oh, no, but I got a free ticket. I got a free ticket. I need to build a... a camp site. That's what I'm going to focus on. I'm not paying off the house. Uh, yep, there we go. Then I can have villagers visit. 
so increase the chances of getting villages I want. Alright, well that's everything as it should be, at least what I care about. For the time being. Ah, oh, damn it, why couldn't I get the, t the talk to my villagers one sooner? Okay. 50 additional slots, nice. So now all this stuff is unlocked, which is good. But then, hang on. That's going to be useful for making thumbnails. Um, wait, but where's the... Where's the design browser? Hmm. Unless that's, that's another upgrade still. I swear it was just a button you would press. Island Life Rescue Service, Passport, Map, Critopedia. Nope, nothing. Alright. What did I buy? Reactions, lock fence, nope. Ugh, that's probably one more upgrade before it gets to the browser. Damn. Alright, um, I may as well just buy the song for today. <laughs> I can buy a Switch. Okay. Moon rug, moon cakes. <laughs> kind of want to get that. Never know. I might be able to do something with this. Don't buy a mismatch in clothes. I'm buying just clothes in general. So then I have just as much creativity as I want. I'm bad at style. I mean, highly subjective, but sure. thing. Okay. I mean, that's nice, but I won't bother just yet.
if I want the 30 old tradey look or 60 year old uncle and I have an amazing wardrobe. But see, you make it sound like, you know, out of the thousands of clothes that I was able to pick from, those are the ones I picked. It's not the case. It's like, I had maybe 10 pieces of clothing item that I could get at any given point. It's not like this is years, years upon years of stuff. Like, this is what I have, and I just don't want to look the same every day. And if it's amusing, then great. Bonus streamer points for me. <laughs> Even if you hate it, I win. Haha. -ha. Engagement! that rock. Alright, get rid of that thing. I'm gonna see if I can make a campsite now. It's like if you saw this on day one, and then you're like, you pick shit clothes. I'm like, what? This is the clothes they gave me. There's no, there's no store where I can buy new clothes. This is all I have. Unless you want me to walk around naked. Okay, um... Are you wanted my help? Okay, it's prime ready for major events. Started with deserted island. I want to do something grand to celebrate. Big plans, go. Got attention, hmm? Our goal is to have the incredibly popular musician KK Slider come and put on the show. Yes. I always knew you had excellent taste. Well, by the way, his song KK Lament is my way to my go to karaoke song. Oh, sorry about that. As you might guess, I'm a big fan. It's easy to get sidetracked talking about him. Back to our goal, if we hold a KK concert here, Shamblona could become a household name. Done a lot of, so far to further the development of this island, but the KK show would be the culmination of all our hard work. I'd love your cooperation. Okay, yeah, but... Um, let's talk about infrastructure. Oh. I guess the option's not there to have a campsite. The renovation, we have something new for the okay, This service makes it easy to add major projects, such as bridges and inclines. Okay. Be advised, you can only have either a bridge or incline on the construction. Um, I'm gonna have to think about this one, but probably a bridge. I went for this one last time and it was like, yeah, I mean, it's the most expensive option, but... It I think I'll probably go for this one this time. I'm probably gonna get brick textures. Okay. I keep forgetting to boot up my other file and download the hat that I had. Okay, uh, 
where am I gonna connect this? I mean, probably here. A guide. Just want to see that it lines up with what I plan to do. to go up one higher, but I don't think it's going to let me do that. Oh. No. Nah. The shape of the river is too awkward. Uh. I mean, the old... Yeah, it's not going to work. So what's going to happen is the path is going to be aligned here, and we'll go here. But I want it so then it lines up with this. Okay, let's not worry about that one now. I think it looked great before. This is the issue is, because it's a path that's too high, like I mean two tiles high. So if I go with what it is here, That'll, this will be the top of the the bridge, and then this will be the bottom. So then the path would be here, and it would stop. It wouldn't line up. This part would go across like this. What I want it to do is meet up with this, so then this is the top. Like, you'll see what I mean. You can change it, though, later. That's the thing. When I get the shovel, I can change it properly. I can always put this bridge up later. I can... Instead, if I want to get to this island... There's the old alternative of putting it here instead. Well, not here, yeah, but maybe. Yeah. obscure. I'm thinking in the long run. I'm not thinking short term here. Right now it might be, but later on it won't be. Plus I'll want to cut across this island anyway. Eventually. Okay, so... Just want I'm curious about something. Make this just keep following this in a straight line. Stick issue, Jesus, to go to school. 
you have a river you need to cross. I think this is fine. Because I'm probably gonna set up like some bombing stuff on this side. Eventually. The way I would fix this would be to just, once the land thing is in place, just chip away this part of land until roughly here. So then it's just flat. And then it's a bit more open, so that's what I'm probably gonna do. There's no river near your house, now what do you need a stick for? Unless you want to go back to like how school was in the 70s. Yeah, I'm gonna go with this. Cross the sea with a stick. You're planning to part that sea? My plan is to move, to move the museum pretty much to here, to this island, and then set up a nice exhibit sort of thing here. I just need to clear this land. I don't think there's any fruit trees here. I probably won't commit to it today, but I'm thinking museum will go here and then the clothing store will go where the museum was. So then it's like, hey, this is a dedicated spot for museum, maybe a park or something, I don't know. But this works, so now I just need to make this line up. The 70s, that was a decade of toy born. No, no, but that was the last time they used stuff like rulers and shit to hit people. That's what I was getting at. It's like, if you're not going to cross a river for school, then the only other thing you can use a stick for is whatever that kind of punishment was. Find a good spot for the bridge, yeah? Now as part of the key setup, Lloyd will collect donations for the construction trees. Owls and residents can contribute little by little. Once we reach our goal, construction will begin. Corporal punishment ended in 95. I know. I'm just saying. <laughs> it's like you're saying you want to stick for school. If you're not crossing over, it's like, damn, what are you going to use it for? Corporal punishment, gonna low-key bring that back. The joke is it was banned already. Alright, well, this is fine. I've got I've got what I wanted out of this. How much is it's not that expensive the bridge. Across the Pacific <laughs> to leap. I always hang on to about 10k. I mean, where would you want to leap to? Leap to Chile. Here, uh, where is that? Uh... 
Okay. I was trying to do this. Hey. Oh, it's like an it's an indoor decoration. Okay, this is open now. Mermaid dresser, really? <laughs> oh, well, no chance I'm gonna make a hot item today. Of, of all of all the items to get, it's the one that involves some of the rarest stuff. I mean, I guess if I make one, it would sell really well. Is it? I'm sure it would. Um. We can get more stuff in store later. Not that I'm gonna put this up. What is that item? What item? The skull? It's a CD player. You want not a goth? Or the mermaid dresser thing. I mean, if you're into that sort of thing, you'd probably like it. People like the mermaid thing. You're not a goth. Damn. I thought for sure with the whole wanting to jump across the Pacific with a stick, that's pretty goth behavior, behavior you know? Villages. Oh. Oh. It's a lot of. Wait, this is the very creepy toy. <laughs> Do you want to play with my Pete Surprise Box? Yeah. Go right ahead. I love having someone talk about this stuff. No one really gets it, you know. I don't, I don't know what to say about this. Hmm, what's going on? You had a snack break today? Uh, not yet. What? Why not? Snack time's five of the most important meals in the day. This dude has a stove, are you kidding? I mean, if it wasn't for the dirt floors, this would be nicer than my place right now. Okay, one more villager. Talk to Audi. Where is everyone? Uh, 
Uh, is this something significant? Probably not. It's gonna be a sea bass. Yep. Ah. Ah. It just looks like it's a, it's a broom handle. Like it's got the, it's got the thing on the end that would make it look like it's gonna go inside a a broom. This isn't a special pole. Ow. That's why they're indoors. I was looking for Alice the whole time, but she moved inside. You are more than welcome to wait out the rain here, Governor. Yes, that's how all Australians sound. I've been dabbling in poetry, writing. Can I run what I have so far by you? It's good to be where peaches grow. I wonder about other fruits, though. Now that I said it out loud, I'm not sure the rhythm works, governor. Governor! Welcome, well, in case you don't remember, I'm Isabel. I look forward to being of assistance with your life here in Chamblonia. At this counter, I can help you with both general issues and issues you may face with other residents. I can delve into the details when specific concerns arise. No need to worry about that right now. But since you're here, I may as well ask, do you have any specific concerns at the moment? Indeed. Oh, this is exciting, my first official request. Ahem. I'm sorry. That wasn't professional, was it? Now then. How can I help you today? I'm certain you've heard the tune, you can't really miss it. It plays in multiple locations, and it reminds us of the time. I think the current anthem is a classic, but there's always room for improvement. You don't have to be a musician to compose a tune, so if you have any ideas, let me know. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. No, not that. Uh huh. <laughs> Why would I- why would I want that sound in a theme? Okay.
Hmm. Ah, uh, so. That that should sound nice. <laughs> How inspiring! Your new island tune makes me proud to call Shaun Blow in the Isle of My Home. Now then, we'll start using it right away. I hope you enjoy hearing it when you're out and about. That's fine. There's something Mr. Nook would like to discuss with you. When you have a moment, what should I do? I guess they want me to do that. <laughs> I wish I could do the full thing. This is a construction consultation counter. How can I help you? Uh, what should I do? <laughs> I take it this means you are ready to hear the details of my plan to draw KK to hold a concert. I call it Project K. This plan of mine is divided into three main stages. First, we need more visitors to come to our island. Next, we need more folks to move in here. And finally, we work hard to increase the overall image of the island. We'll increase the number of tourists and residents and we'll create a Chamblonia so loved. Word of how great this island will reach KK and he'll accept our offer to host a concert here. So, the first step will increase the number of tourists by adding a campsite. The campsite will make it easier for visitors to experience life here. And it'll make for great PR material too. With that in mind, could you get out your phone? Okay, good. The campsite. I don't want to compose it and give it away. But then Isabel just whistled it immediately. So... <laughs> I just wanted it to be subtle, but that's fine. I want you to craft that and pick a great spot on the island for any campsite. I'm counting on you. But hey, Colrin. <laughs> that's why I was, like, making the instrument just play random notes so that no one would be able to pick up on it. But no, Isabel had to spoil the damn thing. Where am I going to put this? <laughs> Just put him here. Make him camp out here. Because the problem is at the moment, the central island isn't easily accessible, and I want to save that for the museum. And this is all going to be residential. Uh, weeks? Okay, so far. Just... Not really a whole lot to say, other than work. Don't... I don't think I want to put it here. Putting it in high ground seems like it would be annoying. Is this anything? Oh, nice. Oh my gosh. Caught a string fish. Five more and I'll have a guitar fish. <laughs> uh. 
That was something. We have to start training again on Monday. Ugh. Is, I feel like this would be a waste of space if I put a camping site here, like right next to the ocean. But then again, what else would I put here later? <laughs> could make this, I could make this like Melbourne and put like a gigantic Ferris wheel that no one uses. Flower garden by the beach? I don't think that would work. Wouldn't the, wouldn't the salt air, like, be horrible? I mean, I could, of course I can do it, it just... Would it make sense? You know what, there's nothing that says that you can't, like, set up a camp by the beach. Like, just, it's fine. Oh wait, I need to make the kit first. I didn't get handed a kit. Sure there's flowers by the beach? I'm sure there's flowers, but they have to be specific kinds. Like, I, I can't say I've ever seen roses by that close to the beach. Just imagine what you see at a botanic garden. The fanciest of roses and it's like right next to the sand. I need a uh, I might have a lot. I might have a lot. Do I have roses already? I mean, not me personally, but I don't know. You know, it's not the kind of thing I pay attention to. Maybe. I would assume so. I don't think I have roses on the island. I think Tulip is the one I have. Of all the music I get. Of all the music. It's this just clown fart song. Or were they lilies? I don't know. I'm terrible with names. Let's just listen to it. Blah, blah. Make it a beach camp thing. I'm gonna have to chop. <laughs> I'm gonna have to do some more tree cutting, so just preempt it. People camp at the beach, yeah. I think it's fine to put it there. Oh, I need more. I don't have any more wood. I used all of it.
I don't know if I'll destroy this bridge. I don't know if I can be bothered. <laughs> Maybe eventually. Right now, as much as I, I don't want it. I'm gonna laugh if I can't place it here. Okay, hold on. What has happened? What? Why is this so weird? Probably one more across. Then I can put stuff along the side. Yeah, that works. still do yeah I can still walk around it so beach camp okay now I'm gonna go donate the fish I just got Lapas. Uh. Uh. My cousin, before they they banned um custom custom horns for cars in Australia. He had that. <laughs> and then he had to get it undone. Whenever he uh, would drive near our place, he'd, he'd just sound it off because he knew me and my brother would laugh. No matter interest you in a few fascinating facts about the stringfish, yes. A stringfish grows slowly, but also lives quite a long time for a fish, with up to 15 years being typical. Consequently, while it takes a while, they can get quite large, perhaps even up to six feet long. The stringfish is perhaps the best embodiment in the fish world of slow and steady wins the race. And there you have it. Okay. Well, I mean, I think it's safe to go island hopping. Because now I should be able to expand the villages again. Especially since I'm building a camp, so... I thought about making it Funky Town again, but I just wanted something different. That is not a lot. Island hopping. 
I can only do one because I spent all my nook miles that I saved up on the uh the expanded inventory, the pro designer, all that stuff, so. Okay, that sounds awesome for this. <laughs> it's got the right tune. All right, let's see who I won't get. Assuming I got anyone, but I've been told that I seem to have ridiculous luck getting cute villagers. So we'll see. I still have Magilla. Yeah, but, you know, they're not gonna move out anytime soon. Yeah, I have lilies. There's no island. There's no vis visitor. There is no villager here. That's what I meant. Sad. to try some fancy coke flavor today they have some weird thing where it's i don't know how true it is but they just said the recipe was designed by ai it's gimmicky but they were like oh the year the year 3000 flavor experience the drink from the future So it was like a spin on the zero sugar one, but but I don't know I don't know what I would say it tastes like. It has some sort of flavoring, but I wouldn't be able to put my finger on it what it was. It leans closer to Pepsi. That's all I know, but it's not Pepsi. The can was pretty fancy. Would I buy it? I, I'm not sure I like it, that's the thing. I'm, I don't hate it, but I'm not sure I. it would be a sort of thing where I would make it my regular drink, I guess. Or not too regular, just like if I was to have a choice. You have those non-alcoholic margaritas, mojitos, and Aperol. That's nice. Non-alcoholic mojitos are pretty good. I like mojito as a drink in general. Mojito.
Yeah, I don't know. I, I might try it again just to get us. Because the can is tiny, that's the thing. It's. It's one of the, the very small ones. So you don't get a lot of it. for this. I bet it, it's... The drink would probably taste like how I imagine the futuristic Coke from Back to the Future tasted like. this weird thing. What brand was it? It was Coke. It's... They have them at 7-Eleven. That's, um... Hang on, I'll find it. Yeah, Coca-Cola imagines the year 3000 with a new futuristic flavor with AI-powered experience. So, yeah, let me... I mean, I don't, I don't want to, like... Not a, I should be like, not a sponsor, don't, this is for the sake of conversation. Um, but you know, it, it's this. This is what I got. F future flavored? I, I don't know what to call it, but it's this. If, if you're intrigued, go, go to 7-Eleven. Petrol station drinks need a home loan. Not if you buy two of them. And that's pretty much the only reason. It's like, someone else was like, do you want one? I'm like, yeah, you know what, screw it. If you buy, t if you buy two out of 7-Eleven, it's basically standard retail price. Like, that's the thing. Never buy one at 7-Eleven. So you always have to go in with someone. Otherwise, you're just, you're losing money. The can looked really nice, I will say that, but... Still has too many calories. I mean, if you care about that stuff, sure. Oh, 
can't turn out diabetic like an Italian granny. That is fair. But one one can of it isn't gonna do that to you. Now, if you're drinking that every day, or practically every day, yeah. For sure. <laughs> the gateway can. Just, your, your pupils are gonna dilate and then that's it, like... No more water, just... Coke Gear 3000. And then when they stop selling Coke Gear 3000, you go have a standard Coke Zero. The taste doesn't satisfy you, and you slowly go insane and eventually raid Coca-Cola Amatil. And demand that they bring back the Year 3000 flavor. They sell it in a 10 pack apparently. Yeah. I mean, it was it was alright. It's just the flavor's weird. And I, I I don't say that in a bad way, it's just not what I was expecting. But I mean America always gets just different flavors of drinks. rather try one and then buy ten. Yeah, ten's a hefty commitment. Me, it was, oh, I'm here, someone's gonna get one. I may as well get one because it's like, it's gonna make theirs cost less and I'm kind of thirsty. That's pretty much what it was. Never have you ever bought food or drink at a petrol station. Hmm. I mean, food, understandable. Drink. As long as someone else gets one with you, the, the price isn't bad. this when I get back. Oh, I think I can craft an axe while I'm here. Mm-hmm. 
think we're done. What was it for? Cream and... Oh. I think I bought that. But it might look different. Alright, well, no villager here. I guess I should do the stretch thing. I did a bottle wash ashore. I don't think one did. Australia must be the bare basics of everything. Uh, I mean, I'd say we we're somewhere in the middle. Because there are some countries that don't have McDonald's or KFC, so they're... You know. Like, we're not too bad. We at least have some things. Not everything, but some. It was just a sea bass as well. I'm not sure. Like, the coffee thing... We just... Maybe it's just Melbourne and Sydney specifically that just... have such high standards. trying to get Mrs. Ham to try it, pumpkin spice. Listen. Pumpkin spice is effectively like done in a frappe at uh at Starbucks. And just ignore the name. It's just some weird Americanism. They're basically saying things they associate with fall in terms of flavor. It tastes like a cookie. If you're not a fan of super sweet stuff, you probably won't like it. It's just the same thing. It's just, if you have it with coffee, it's just a bunch of syrup they're going to put in it. It's a master coffee flavor. Starbucks has shit coffee. Yeah, I, I agree. I went to want to try this pumpkin spice thing, but not the coffee, like in a frap. And I noticed the people in there, no one was getting coffee. Everyone was just getting ice flavored beverages. So, whether it be fraps or, like, those cooler things that I guess are tea, I don't know. But no one was getting coffee. And that's, that's pretty telling. And at least at the one that I went to, the crowd was just mothers. Pretty much. Alright. 
who goes for a coffee at Starbucks? Well, uh, when you hear the place start, when the name of the business is called Starbucks Coffee, you would assume you would go there for a coffee. And that's what we would think. It's like if you were to tell me, what, why do you go to KFC for chicken? The coleslaw is where it's at. I think I've read this one. I do love the coleslaw. I don't like it. I think it's so it's too soggy and sweet. It's the KFC bread buns. They don't have that though, Mrs. Ham. They have biscuits, which I'm kind of jealous of. Like, we have just sugar bread, basically. <laughs> Instead of biscuits. I'm surprised they haven't classified it as cake, to be honest. Yeah, it's the modern rhinoceros equivalent. <laughs> Biscuits are dry. I mean, do you want something that's really soft and sugary and is just bread instead? I guess we went with the opposite. It's just very, very soft white bread that is laced with sugar. That's pretty much what they give us instead of biscuits. I bought one of these. Oh, I forgot to sell the seaweed. I don't know why I grabbed one. I mean, when it comes to coffee, that's the thing. I can't really say much because my heritage is, you know, Central American and we're big on coffee. But also I live in Melbourne, so it's like, of course, the two high coffee standards. Like, I just, I just don't think I could ever settle. I'm gonna make a couple because I'm gonna chop, 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 chop. <laughs> they have no flavor. It's very dry. It's good with honey to moist them a bit. I wonder if they're healthier. I n I never eat the bread from KFC because it's, it's just sugar bread basically. to do the powdered coffee thing like Greek and Turkish coffee powdered coffee I mean I know the farmers breakfast there is basically just black coffee and then something sweet um it wouldn't surprise me and the other thing they do is like uh cocoa actual actual tablet that you boil That stuff's pretty good. It's a bit grainy, but I like it. Do I make coffee at home? I used to until my machine broke. Haven't got in a replacement, so now it's just... I don't really drink it that often. I'm more on tea these days. And if I want a coffee, I'll go out to a local coffee place and get one.
Did I use Bane or Grad? I would get Beans from, um... It was like a, a roaster near where I used to work. I would get it from there. Just buy it by the bag. I would have gotten a replacement already, but it's just... <laughs> I have more kitchen counter space now. And I don't think I want to go back to it until maybe I move somewhere bigger. Capsules, but that's still better than what they would offer elsewhere, I think. It's still better than Starbucks. Now I'm moving. No, just long-term move. I'm not going to stay here forever. This is like an eventual- an eventuality. Not a short-term thing. I mean, I don't know, who knows. Housing. Yeah, that's. That's, uh, yeah. This is gonna take 20 minutes, I reckon. To chop all this. When am I planning a vacation? Not this year, most likely. Yeah. I want to try, but just a couple of things that might prevent that. In the next six months or so will let, will let me know.
I ran out of this stuff so quickly. I did this last time and still ran out pretty much the same day. Museum. I might have to wait because that might fall somewhere where I can't actually have it land. Dino so far. I mean, Sure, I'll put that if anywhere. Because the other thing I need to do is upgrade my computer. So, right now, budgets are going towards that at the moment. As this, this thing is like almost seven years old now, so. I think it's even seven years old now. So, I need to do that first. If I upgrade, I mean get a whole new thing, because upgrading is not really an option. This is coming up, maybe a good one will go on sale. I mean, I'm gonna go with like a, a build. So I'd be getting parts and then making it. As pre-built ones, they don't, they don't do the job for what I want it for. Like they're just aimed at casual use. The stuff that's more high-end, like, say, Alienware, because it's Alienware, they just mark up the price. You can probably build something yourself for less. I mean, for me, it's gonna be work and hobby. Pretty much. It's like... Entertainment, oh, hobby, gaming. And work. I, uh... I would want something that... Uh-oh. Like... can record oh my god 
crap it got me. Well, it had to get me at some point. So, how did I get stung in the eye? Yeah, I would want something that could record 1440p video without struggling. As a bare minimum. Give me the recipe for medicine. No, huh. I thought getting stung would give you that. Did I finish tunic? Yeah. Technically, yes, but there's one thing I just didn't solve because it's just beyond uh, my skill level. The last puzzle I had to solve, you pretty much have to know how to read the language. And I made my best attempt at it, but it's something that's straight up, it, it's a multi-hour process. Like, it's not a very simple thing to decipher, it's one of those things that Less than 1% of the people that play that game will be able to do that. Which I'm fine with, I don't have to do everything. So, yeah, I found all the treasures except one which was hidden behind me solving that puzzle. So I just didn't look it up, I was happy with just letting that be it. Got it for talking to a villager. Oh, okay, hang on. The game was good. Just did not expect I would have to go to that much effort to try and solve stuff. I had a feeling I'd run into you. The bugs are loving the springtime, and I'm loving it too. Is it because I'm wearing sunnies and... Wow, it is. I'm surprised by your, your face, I made a word. Did you get stepped on? Or bit by a fish? Did you fall off your roof? Or get stung by a wasp? Yeesh. That looks painful. Hurry up and get better, okay? Hey, I know. I'll teach you my super special medicine recipe. Get a wasp nurse? Anyone is okay. It doesn't need to be a trendy label. BT dubs. This is the only time I'll ever tell you a label isn't important, okay? I've got an image to keep. Anywho, you need some weeds, mush the lost nest and the weeds together, and boom, medicine. You should go make some, La Pronto, and get all better. Okay. Because I pressed the button to go in the door and didn't put the axe away, so it swung at the door. Another- Jeez, oh, not leaving me alone with these balloons.
Oh, you've got to be kidding. There we go. <laughs> Office desk. Drop. Why is drop the first option? Take. <laughs> Did I pick this music? I bought it. Thinking it would be... I don't... Because I didn't have music. So I thought, okay. I should buy some music. This was all I had on sale. So in a way I did, but it's not like I had many to choose from. It was just the one. did play the DLC for this. The happy home thingy. I did a bit of it. I just designed a bunch of stuff and then let it be. The VODs are up on YouTube for that because I had drive space so at the very least me going through that DLC is there. Just sadly not the original 2020 island thing. As a pandemic happened. <laughs> it's just, yeah. I didn't have drives. Uh, I guess I'll go up here. Gonna be a problem again now. I have plenty of space. That's great. They stung me through my my glasses. You like decorating, but have no decorating skills, IRL. But, so, you could pick stuff out, though. Oh, there goes the axe. Like, you know, I know what looks good. If Would I be able to, like, do that DIY myself? Hell no. game, yes. Your house in IRL has no decorations, but it's probably easier that way. Less cleaning. If you have decorations, you have to do way more dusting.
Lumbar. <laughs> this is all this is. Do I have enough miles to go somewhere? Yeah, okay. I have I have enough to get a ticket. I kinda need to do it anyway because I need to get bamboo. Otherwise I won't get the spring event stuff. Well, at this point... At this point, it doesn't matter. Oh, you get a knock mile thing for it. All right, yeah, intentional. Totally intentional. <laughs> ah, sweet silence. Watch me run into another one. That's where I left off. I need to also, I guess, get on top of flower arrangements. I need to look up <laughs> how, you, how you do it again. It's been a long time. I just can't win. I don't want to shake every swap, shake every tree. It's just it's gonna take so much longer. ever been stung by a bee once, so. My frame of reference for how painful that bee would be. It's, it's not high. Alright, I mean, I think that's enough for now. I don't have to do the whole island. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, yeah. Medicine again. It's what, three times now? Customize my slingshot before it breaks. Oh shit, wrong thing. Uh, I guess I saw these bugs. I'll get a ticket. I'll go to another island. Expecting more than that. Man. You really don't make that much money from bugs unless it's very specific stuff. Yeah, jeez, I forgot like, to come back here. I can proceed with the construction. Tomorrow we'll have a wonderful campsite for visitors. Oh, there you go. Okay. What would have happened if I didn't talk to him? Like, surely that would have happened anyway. I think I forgot to do. Change the island flag. I need to fix that. <laughs> it doesn't look good. I might just... <laughs> I might just use the, uh... The online tool to make it. Because then at least it guarantees it's like the right shape and everything. I don't have to mess around with trying to... Draw something with an analog stick. I mean, it'll, it'll do for now. It's not great. Just so I can get the miles. All right. Oh, 
I think it sounds best, yeah. I mean, if there's no villager in this one, then there probably won't be. haven't had luck finding islands that either have the sister fruit or bamboo. There's no... There's no villager here either. Okay. I mean, probably from tomorrow once the campsite's up. It's fine. Still wanted to try for a bamboo island. Eventually, I'll stop picking the weeds once I've sold the final amount. What? A throwback gothic mirror. I'm not sure what that would look like. Landed on top of me. Okay. Everything's fine. Alright, now I don't have to be afraid. It's worth catching that because it is worth some money. with me. Okay. 
Well, I'm gonna have to get more. Watch me be unlucky. <laughs> Not be able to get this. should be enough to make it. Shovel, there it is. Now at the very least I can do this. I'll upgrade it once I'm done digging. Oh, that one's already done. <laughs> I completely forgot. any more rocks. Should probably try for this fish just in case it's something rare. Might have to do a session of this where I'm playing this in my normal time zone. Ah! 
Okay, now I'm done. Tell. Big fish. No, save us. I didn't react to it quickly, and it still caught it, so that's how I know. Is he watering the plants? No, reading a book. <laughs> They're already watered. Yeah, what is this? Oh. Apparently this is this tiny mirror. <laughs> this tiny mirror. Can I place it on the stump? No. I was expecting something more sizable. I was expecting something like, you know, evil Disney witch size mirror. not goth. I mean, there's overlap. Hey, Will. Thanks for coming over to say hi. It's real cool that I made a new friend the same day I moved. So, um, I brought a present for you today. This makes us officially licensed friends now. An oil barrel bathtub that I made. Making those is kind of my secret skill, you know? They're great decorations too. So you can stick them anywhere. Can't wait to have lots of nap times around here. Maybe the whole island can nap together be like night time but at some other weirder time like um man any time is weird for this idea huh <laughs> a little this is how so i'm gonna be like one of those anime characters that has a bath outside
<laughs> it's actually like that. But I can't hop into it. I question the practicality of this thing. How, how do you empty it? It would seem like a lot of effort. like weird music really loudly it sounds like they're playing meditation music or something i'm just hearing something in the background I'm like what is that like it, it just sounds like meditation music like something <laughs> you would close your eyes over and just sit on the carpet or some shit Except they're playing it really loudly. I, I don't know how else to put it. You don't hear it? No, you wouldn't be able to hear it. I can hear it. It's not loud enough for it to come through the microphone, but it's loud enough that when there was silence in there, I just heard something. I took my headset off for a second and... I was like, what? <laughs> Who is playing... That kind of music at 10 o'clock at night, loudly. Made zero sense. I mean, if you sleep to that music, you would not have it loud enough that your neighbors can hear. That's, that's what... It's it's not the music that's weird, it's the fact that it's being played out super loudly. I think it's the strange part. It's the sort of thing that you would imagine, you know, very quietly in the background or you have headphones on. That's the kind of music it is. Get them miles. Oh, everyone's here practically. Fit I'm wearing is kind of funny. It's just random items that I bought from the store today.
good coordination. <laughs> it's like pretty hard to get it to time correctly with what they're doing. You fall behind and then that's it. I think I lucked out. More miles. That's for two times. So this wants me to a mole cricket, that's annoying. Yellow perch. Ugh. I haven't got good ones. Unfortunately. The mole cricket's a very big hassle to catch. To listen. I'll try to look for it, but it might not be around anymore. I'm guessing it's gone now. Do I have a paper cut butterfly? I have no idea. Hey. Hey. Okay. Maybe I do. Ooh. That's a new one. Orchid Mantis. I haven't heard a single cricket, so... Wait, to hear one now, I think. Oh, that was a... That was a fluke. <laughs> Usually takes me ages to find it. Got it first try. as well go donate the orchid mantis. Hold on, balloon. ever do with that. Let's learn. Oh, 
The orchid mantis is a bug whose brilliant colours and petal-shaped limbs give it the look of a flower. This masterful mim mimicry allows it to hide from predators and among the orchids. Oh, but this fraudul this fraudulent flower lures other insects in to drink its nectar and makes a meal of them instead. Imagine to behold a beautiful bud, only to discover it's a bug instead. A repulsive revelation indeed. I don't think I have stuff to sell. I guess a less complicated way to do this would be collect shells. It's not going to get me a whole lot, but I want to sell 5,000. Seabass! Enough of these, and it should get me 5,000. Damn, that's a lot of shells. I don't usually see this many. See how much this gives me. critter thing. I haven't done that today. We haven't gotten a scallop for stone or otter. Hmm. 
It makes me laugh every time that you don't bother to take off your hat. Or shoes. extra inventory now so I can make more money before I have to go back I found a lot of crabs last time so we'll see how we go to be moving semi quickly. Yes. Okay, that's promising. enough. It's kind of hard to judge on this angle. At least they don't go out of bounds like they did in, in New Leaf. Got it. I got this already so I can sell this. That's, that's some money right there. Crab has already made this triple effort. Yeah. 
need a scallop. So then Stoner Otter can drop some words of wisdom. another quick one. Come on. There we go. It's smaller crab, but that's fine. Still worth. There it is. <laughs> Just instantly pops up. Hey, man. About that scallop of yours. Can I have it? Sure. Oh, thanks for your generosity, man. Since you are cool, I left you something you'll dig. While I'm at it, let me lay some truth on you. The deep kind. Feel this. Before you blow your bells on fancy shades, realize you can just squint. Stick it to big sunglasses, man. Consider yourself truth. Yep, today is a good day. Did he say that because I was wearing sunglasses? <laughs> Before buying sunglasses, just squint. Strange little otter. I still wonder what he does with all, all of them. Does he eat one every day, or is he amassing a pile? I ate them? Okay. Yeah. He gave me another pearl. He's been giving me nothing but pearls. Just kinda lucky. Okay. Another pearl. I think I have five of them now. Got another ten to go. I may as well fill up the inventory and sell.
I'll just put whatever money I have into the bridge construction. I don't think I'll finish it today. easier to judge it now. Directly on top of it. Again with the crabs. Except this time I can sell all of them. Three more. Stack of money. Got it. Alright, time to sell. Crab, it's that crab money.
Zero, 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 zero. Ah, that's getting there. As I said, not gonna get done today, but I think I got through half of it. Do I have any easy... Let's see. I mean, I'm not going to buy anything. Fish. Whoa. Uh. Alright, I'll do the fishing one. Do you need a bridge? You can just erase the water. I mean, eventually, yeah. I think you need bridges for progression. They're like a prerequisite for certain upgrades, if I'm not mistaken. Like, I think you need two or one bridge, one incline, and then you get more options. Statue. It's one of the first items I got. I didn't know what to do with it, so I just shoved it there for now. I've never gone to see it, really. Is it one of those things because you've got it nearby? You're like, eh, yeah, yeah, I'll see it at some point. I'm surprised you haven't seen it even in like a field trip capacity. Yahoo! I've only been to the major touristy stuff here because I've had people visit, but on my own. I mean, yeah. Field trips in school. Still didn't manage to find the yellow perch. Alright, you would have been in school during 9-11. Yeah, that makes sense. For them to stop doing them. Alone. Worth it. 
take 10,000 bells. Yellow perch. Where is yellow perch? Not even that rare of a fish. is fish. Oh, almost didn't catch that. I've been trying... Wow, okay. I've been trying not to mess up. Keep catching more fish in a row. I'm not sure what my total is at, but I haven't I haven't messed up in a while. Hey, drop branch. A stack of tires. Hopefully the music I ordered will be better than what I currently have. It's not exactly a very high bar I've set for that. Bar is quite low. I'll probably remove the wet seat now.
not a single river fish. Hang on. Oh, no one's crafting today. I'm so happy you came. Let's talk. Don't I look amazing in this tropical moo moo? I usually only wear it when I practice dancing, but it turns out I can rock it whenever. That's not Will. The secret to setting up chic trends, don't dress by the rules. Is it you that has the recipe today? There it is. <laughs> very blue, very, very blue room you got here. I nearly sprained my creativity. What do you think? What is it? You're not going to believe it. I made a simple DIY workbench. It's somewhat- everyone could make a simple here. Okay. Ignore the sweat stains, those aren't part of the recipe. Oh, I already know it. Well, that's disappointing. No one's gonna want this recipe. It's like... One of the most basic ones. At this point, I'm sure everyone has everything, so I don't think I need to save recipes this time. That's what I used to do. I used to throw them in a pile, so then when people visited the island, they could just take what they wanted. But this time, I don't think I need to save it. enough. I thought for sure I'd be on that one. So much for the streak. thing. This is what they should have done in New Leaf instead of, oh hey, you found garbage, congratulations, you're gonna get charged money for it. That took a while. 
yeah, learn to recycle. Or at the very least, have some reward pop up later. Thanking you for cleaning up the town and just saying, oh, we took this money and did this with it. Lifting weights, just staring this down. It's almost like my reward is food. It does not seem like I'm going to catch this pitch. There we go, got it. Finally! I can't water flowers because it was raining earlier. So all of them got watered. Hold on. Never mind. It's not at the mouth of the river. That's a nice round number. Just magically added up to that. was a solid three and a half hours. <laughs> Alright, well, that's gonna do it for uh, Animal Crossing for today. Thanks for watching if you're watching later on YouTube as well. Uh, yeah. We'll do more of this soon. If you wanna, in the meantime, support the channel or watch more stuff, uh, there's the like button to be clicked, and also I'm sure two other videos have popped up as well if you want to check out more of my content. But yeah, till next time. Bye, YouTube.